John Gill's Exposition of the Bible Text And the Lord said unto Moses, Stretch forth thine hand toward heaven, that there may be hail in all the land of Egypt, upon man, and upon beast, and upon every herb of the field, throughout the land of Egypt. Exodus 9 22 Commentary And the Lord said unto Moses, When the morrow was come, the fifth day of the month of Eve, Stretch forth thine hand toward heaven, with his rod in it, as appears from the next verse, to show that the following plague would come from the heaven, that is, the air, and from God, who dwells in the heaven of heavens. That there may be hail in all the land of Egypt, not only in that spot, and near it, where Moses stood, and from that part of the heaven towards which he stretched forth his hand, but from the whole heaven all over the land of Egypt, which shows it to be an unusual and extraordinary hail, for a hailstorm seldom reaches far, a mile it may be, or some such space, but never was such in one heard of as to reach through a whole country, and so large in one as Egypt. Upon man and upon beast, such as belong to those who would take no warning, nor attend to the word of the Lord to fetch home their servants, and cattle, and upon every herb of the field throughout the land of Egypt, it should fall so thick, that scarce an herb would escape it.